A few years ago now, I wrote a kind of a tongue-in-cheek poem about the extinction of the human race. I suppose you could say the extinction to end all extinctions. And of course, we're all dead and there's no one left to talk about us except a handful of cockroaches and a few old crocodiles. And so my poem is called Said the Cockroach. Come all ye salty crocodiles and listen to my song. Concerns a species now extinct, so it won't keep you long. Their brain power far exceeded ours. It was vast and quite immense. Man, they could fly like moths around the moon. But they had no common sense. And they didn't like it here, my friends. They didn't like it here, said the cockroach to the crocodile. Well, they mustn't have liked it here. And they multiplied a million fold and a million fold again. Half a dozen monkeys left and a hundred billion men. And then down the trees and up the seas, never stopped to think. There was water, water everywhere, but not a precious drop to drink. And they invented sin and religion and then fought like cat and dog because each one had the right one every man and his god and they bombed and burned each other for gods of love how queer and for virgins up in heaven and i suppose they just didn't like it here next they dug a great big hole 10 mile by 10 mile square and they were told uranium would kill them they didn't seem to care they copped a bellyache from the yellow cake. The cost was shocking dear. And they scuttled their ship on that final trip because they didn't like it here. They didn't like it here, my friends. They didn't like it here, said the cockroach to the crocodile. Well, they mustn't have liked it here. They didn't like it here, I'm saying. The facts are all too clear. That's why there's just the two of us left. The others? They mustn't have liked it here. <laughs>